Good morning and welcome back to our Let's Play of HR New Beginnings. Hello, hope you're well and thanks for coming back. Right, some things have changed. You can see my heart on my armour, which is kind of strange. Let's go back into normal view. Right, I had a horrible experience yesterday. You'll notice some things have changed. While I was doing all the other things, um, bump, ba -dump, ba -dump, where is it? Husbandry, no, nature's aura. Um, one of these, I had a horrible one. I'm Patrick, no, can I find it? No. Okay. It basically meant that the aura had got down to dangerous levels. And I went, ah! So. I had to make an eye because I needed to see just how bad it was. And if you look at the top corner of my screen, it says aura around and normal is about the middle. So if I move around, if I go this way and move around because it was barely able to see what's going on. But as we move over here where we've not been doing any aura things, it gets back to sort of middle-ish scale. And that's just normal background aura, so that's fine. But up here, what happens is, if you start getting too low, you get bad effects. And they're not fun. They can kill plants, kill animals, kill you. Um, I've heard about lightning storms, all manner of things. So, I had to come up with a drastic solution. I had to make some aura. So I put, this. I made an ancient tree. And as you can see, the leaves, are, from what it was, they're slowly decaying. But as they decay, the aura from those goes in the sky. And it's made a difference because, look, this has got all the parts are making aura. So I thought to start us off with, before we do anything else today, we'll make another one that may be put over here. Down there. That sounds fun. So I've got it all laid out, we would need a tree, um, some sugar cane, a poppy, uh, some seeds, a golden leaf, and a daisy is that? Hang on, I'm pretty sure that's a daisy, hold on. Dandelion, daisies, okay. And I had to go on quite a trek to find those as well, because they just... We only seem to have the orange and the white, the ox oxy daisy and those orange ones. Couldn't find any more, so we just went wandering and wandering and wandering. But we're going to make another one. So we're all ready to go. Let's see what we can do when we make this. Voila, there we go. And everything's going to pop in a minute. I do love this. I think it's a fantastic effect, especially that bit where it goes. And that'll turn over in a minute. Oh, there we go. There's our tree. No, I don't want you there. You can switch off that auto planting if you want to in the um, config files. But no, this is the mod pack. That's what I'm playing with. I want some dirt. There we are. And... Here we are. That'll do. And let's put it there. I do take a while to actually... Oh, no, no. There. They do take a while to grow. So we're going to give it a bit of a hand. There. Boom. And that should increase the aura. Low. But you can see how many branches down lower. And then when you look, you see the thing is full. The bar is full. Whereas when you go over here to some of the lower branches, they're empty. So it has no aura. So I may have to get to the place point where it chops down. But I'm learning as I go. Right. Now. Oh. Okay, so the aura meter is very useful. I want a chest. Uh. I'll take two just in case 
Right, so let's have a quick look. So we've got those done, we've got those done, we've made that. I've made some more golden leaves. In the meantime, I've planted two trees, let them grow. Um, infuse the leaves with the brilliant fibre. And we took it from there. Well, now, we're quite full here. And we have been steadily mining away. So I'm going to have to do another bag. Again, thanks to No Pockets, it was, I put, I've got a red one, which has got all my tree stuff in it. I've got my personal one. Well, I've got all the wheat in it. I don't know why I've got all the wheat. Let's have a look. Uh, put that there. Oh, that's right, because I was, I was doing the cows to make all the bags. This was my little AFK station, just in case we got phantoms. Um, books, those, we've got the eye, we've got the bag. Right. When it comes to... Um, silent mechanisms tools I have found that all the materials we're getting a lot of these we won't use much iron so the normal vanilla materials we'll probably use quite a lot but unless we do extensive stuff we may not use much of them I was now I have to say I was quite disappointed because in lots of other mobs mod pack sorry you <coughs> oh excuse me sorry Oh, sorry about that. That was Heidi just having a little hissy fit because someone dared to walk past our house. Uh, yeah, go on, just calm down. Get some sleep. She does like a nap, but when someone disturbs her nap, she gets very upset. Don't you? Look at her yawning head off. Right. Oh, so where were we? Oh, yes. These are the materials. You can't make tools out of them. So if we were to just put like a pick here, normally... We'd put three pieces in to get the tool. And if we could, oh, we'll get the tool parts. So we can't make the tool heads from the other materials. And I tried bronze, I tried steel, bismuth steel, I tried invar. But you can make them out of iron, gold, and diamond. As you can see now, because I had to get some... No, nope, didn't have to. I chose to get some obsidian. So I had to put a diamond head on my tool. So that, that meant I could actually get obsidian. There is also something that seems to be missing from the pack as well, which is, it's called a tool analyzer. Let's, hang on, let me try tool analyzer, no. Bone blaze rod, toad store, enchanted. No. So it just shows ancient wood rod. What can we make the rods with? Because if you make, if you if you had a tool analyzer, which I thought was in the in the mod pack, your tools are slightly better. There's different grades of tool heads, which there aren't in this. So for the minute, that is what we have. Right. They are quite impressive trees, aren't they? Yeah, look at that. All the ore has already gone from that one. And that one is leaving. So I think it works lower down. Right, next. I'll tell you what. We're just going to go down here. To talk about these plants. Right, oh, actually, as, we've, as we're down here, I might be able to do some harvesting. So the first thing is, let's get these. This is in very, this is very grind. You've got to love the grind to do this. Because um, growing these and then converting the soil to the next tier up. Uh, let's have a look. Five, five, six, seven. Oh, look at 
look at that one more we need one more okay we'll have a look in a minute uh, converting all of those and making the mo the farmland um, took about four hours and that's we haven't even managed to get very far into it yet so that's going to be a work in progress Whoop. and here we go can we get another one is there going to be one spawn no okay let's have a quick look at this the farmland let's have a look at farmland farm right oh agriculture i don't know what that is but it looks nice so farmland now we have inferior farmland which is the inferior essence a hoe and some dirt and if you take the farmland up and no sorry you can't no forgive me so or you can just add that to farmland but you'd need silk put silk touch to do that the next stage is the prudentium farmland which is the same process but with prudentium and it will go up the line now i know in the original mod or the mod pack that's not in here having an improved soil with so uh, we've got tier two soil with a tier one plant means that there is a 10 percent chance that i think it's 10 percent that you'll get another seed or something drop and in all the hours of doing it i've managed to get six inferium seed inferium seeds that weren't here because i haven't been the recycler yet because we've got to go to the nether to get that sorted out so this is incredibly grindy because the aim here would be to say get to diamonds so if we go diamond uh, where is it there so diamond essence to make diamond essence we need diamond seeds which are tier 5 so to get tier 5 we have to have supremium essence each and let's have a look so we go there so that would be four of those each four takes four so we're up to 16 uh, each four takes four so it's 1632 that's 64 plus another four so that's 6400 no it's 122 wow this is maths for you and it's 60 we're 240 uh 256 of course it's 256 because they're multiples they're like the bits and then we then need so we need over a thousand of these in order to make the diamond seed But we can't get extra plants because i think you can make or you used to be able to make i believe these seeds into higher grade seeds which is what i'm trying to figure out if i can do now because we've got eight right let's put those in there we have eight and some seeds so let's have a look because to make uh what are they we use these one wheat seed plus inferium seeds will give you those and let's try one of these as well so we're going to mix it up a bit oh um so first we'll put a seed in here that doesn't add anything to my recipes or add anything so unless i'm in totally missing something and if i am please tell me we can't improve the seeds so i've got to make over a thousand of these to get a seed to make a diamond plant um on past performance that would take well unless there is a way to speed up that i'm not aware of that's going to take days of time right and also because i'm making oh, 
these. Where are we? Uh, a prosperity gemstone. We need. We then need one of those and one of those. Because I'm sure that that makes you Prudentium gemstone, which we then, I believe, will replace that, which will give us three growth accelerators. And as you can see, I've been quite busy down here doing all of these, trying to be anyway. And because they have a range, I'm not sure if the range is directly affected horizontally or is it just vertically. At the moment, I suppose what I could do. Actually, that's an interesting experiment. What I'm going to do. Right, so let's see what this corner does. If this corner here does any better than anywhere else so I'm pretty sure that's the corner let's have a quick look yep and we've got two seed I'll tell you what we're going to do a proper experiment here we'll pick that seed and that seed up it is definitely the farmland now let's take one of these I've got my two seeds I've got my dirt Now, when things tick, you would expect something to go better or worse for them. So if we take that, we've now got right three of these right underneath. We've got the seeds. They're both planted at the same time. That will hydrate in a minute. Oh, and if you don't have a water source, they don't hydrate by the look of things. So put a water source in see because looking through the book I couldn't find any mention about hydration and that should go soon right but that's a long way to and this is just to make the next essence well, you can see how many times I've done it. I've used over a hundred uses of this just to make those and these. Right, so that's that part dealt with. Now, next. Um, oh, yes, I made the enchanting table because I wanted things a bit enchanted because if I'm going to the nether, I want a bit of protection. And last, but by no means least, we need... Whoop! A flint and steel because we are going to the nether because we need I need everything from the nether really so let's have a look I want a steel so that's an iron ingot and a piece of flint so we have flint and iron Let's go. Right. As you can see, my levels are down to 29. Mm. I'd like to get that back up to 30 just so I can enchant my breastplate. Oh, time's a ticking. Oh, well, also, look at this. One of the uh, 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 Depths Rider 3. Look at that. That's a lovely pair of boots. Protection 3, Unbreaking 3, and the helm is Fire Protection 4. So, but... Woof, if I'm through water, I'm going really quick. So I might, we might just have a look at, let's put that there. Now, I have no idea how horrible this nether is going to be. Um, I'll keep a sword because that's quite easy to fix and repair. I want the chest and the flint. I'll leave the eye in the bag. Uh, now I'll take the wood with me because that's easy to repair and replace. That's all I'm taking with me. There we go. Simple, straightforward and easy. So that when we can get there, we can make a protection against gas. So. 
oh, excuse me, a bit of a cough. Right. Are you ready? I know I am. I'm intrigued just to find out just what this nether is. Is it any different? Because I know in the world there's bears. I haven't seen one myself. I've heard of one from one of my uh, some one of the comments on my on this channel. Um, but also as well, um, I've seen a video with one in it, which is what I started playing. This. But forgive me. Oh, loud. I can't remember whose video it was. Right, move. Okay, that's not too bad a spawn. What? Oh. Wow, I don't know what happened there. Tree. That was very strange. Did you see that? I had nothing with me. It just... It just disappeared. Oh, and the nether echoes too. Right. Oh, look, that's wood. Okay. The music seems a bit spookier as well, doesn't it? Not that. Next. I'm quite surprised I've not... That's weird. There is... Oh, no, there's a pigman. That's fine. I was just going to say, where have all the pigmen gone? Okay, that's a bit extreme. Let's just get rid of this and this. I had some bad experiences a long time ago in the nether and I just can't break the habit. It's um. Okay, that's the way we have to go. So let's put the flint and steel there. I do want a couple of stacks of those and we'll put the wood there as well. Right. Let's go. Yeah. I'm not sure that I'm going to need the books or the eye or the seeds. I want some food. I'm not going to take my hammer because I'm not going to be that. I'm not taking that. I mustn't take that. And I've got food. Right. Let's go explore the nether, shall we? Let's see how we're doing. That was pretty strange. Right. Morning. Oh, look at that. We found some ore already. So my question is, do the pigmen object? That's the that's the real question, isn't it? Because some sometimes you will find that in a mod pack, let's move that to there. I don't like you mining things. Yeah. 
So we are very ghast safe now. Right. We've got a tree we've got to take a look at. Oh, that's a mattock. Right. Okay. Hmm. Well, let's head over here, shall we? We have a way to go, that's fine. I don't like getting lost in the nether, so I tend to do those. Oh, look at that, he's got a magic sword, but I'm not going to get involved with him. We might make, eventually, that's a nice sort of flattish area, a, zombie, uh, a pigman farm sort of thing. But we're not doing that just yet. Right, what have we got here? We've got all this wood. We've got more material here. Ooh, don't get close to that edge. Right, let's see, shall we? Uh, no, I'm thinking... Oh, it still needs... So what is this? This is soul sand cobble. Oh, okay. That, that's, and what's that? Solium dust. Come here, you. I'm just not going to risk it, to be honest. Right, come here. Okay. That goes up a long way. So this is cobble. Solium cobble. And in that we're getting the solium dust. And the cobblestone, what can we do with that? Oh, okay, we can fire it into soulstone. Oh, there's a ghast. Mm-hmm. Let's just stand here for a minute. Um, hold on. I thought the music was down. Okay, hostile players. Wait a Nope. Is it the blocks? Nope. Oh, here we are. That's better. There. That was getting quite loud. So what have we got to see over there? Let's go up here first and see what we can see. Oh, okay, that was quite easy. That just sticks out over nothing. So that's not a way forward. Oh, the echo. Okay, I do love the echo sounds. Right, so this way is effectively a dead end. Ho, ho, ho. They sound a bit like sort of monkeys, don't they? Ho, ho, ho. Ho, ho, ho. He's talking to me now. Um. Well, I'm... Oh, that is so good. I can now stop. I need glowstone. Quartz. Not only is quartz good for XP. That's quite a big vein of it. 
That's a huge vein of it. And I'm not complaining. Wow. I wonder if all generation has changed as well, because that, that is an enormous, an enormous vein of... Oh. Which way are we going? Not that way, this way. How many did we get? 26. Right. There's more there. And that's... Come on, do you want to move out of the way? I really don't want to hit you. in the ceiling. There's loads of ores over there. Right, let's get a bit of another rack. That's good. Oh, more. So, we've got some crimson ore, solium dust. Oh, the soul bottles. I wonder if we can reuse those. That would be an important thing if we could. Okay, that was just a rare one by the looks of things then. Oh, boys, all right, calm down, calm down. Nope. Do you think they walk in front of you deliberately? Because... My pick, it's not a bad pick. Oh, that was silly. It's not a bad pick. It would damage them. Right. And. What's that? Oh, it's a little baby one. I'm expecting any manner of mobs to arrive and appear here. We can see over here. Really? That's just putting the fires out is what I'm supposed to be doing. Is that a block of lava coming down, would you say? Right. Actually, we make a map, don't we? Are we going to do this? Come on. Uh, yeah. That's better. Right, well, I have to say, with everyone mumbling in the background, yeah, I know. Oh, there you are. Oh, two of you. Let's come down here. What is that? That's a vein. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to say ta -da for now, because I'm going to spend probably half an hour or so, if not more, wandering around, creating a map, just trying to find materials and ores. So with that, and then when I come back, We'll be back in the normal world and we can see what we can do on part two of building stuff from the nether. So for the time being, this is GP on the PC saying ta-da, take care, be safe. And again, special thanks to all those people who've subscribed, who watch. Thank you so much. Really, really is amazing. And if you do want to leave a like or a comment... Feel free. Thank you very much indeed. And again, special shout out to the Hillies, Car Car, Galaxy Pause and HR Dog. Take care, everyone. See you all soon. Bye-bye for now.